Have you ever wondered how our world evolved from simple hunter-gatherer societies to complex civilizations? Well, the secret lies in a transformative period that happened around 3500 BC to 3000 BC. This was a time when humankind made leaps and bounds in innovation, birthing 10 groundbreaking developments that would forever change the course of history. We'll be taking a deep dive into each of these milestones, understanding their importance and how they continue to shape our lives today. From the invention of the wheel in Mesopotamia, the birth of cuneiform writing, the rise of city-states in Sumer, to the start of the Bronze Age, we'll marvel at the construction of ziggurats, the development of Egyptian hieroglyphics, and the formation of the Indus Valley Civilization. Not to forget, we'll explore the Koral Soup Civilization, the construction of Stonehenge, and the early dynastic period in Egypt. Prepare to step back in time as we uncover how these key developments laid the groundwork for our modern world. Picture a world without wheels. Hard to imagine, isn't it? Yet that was the reality until around 3500 BC, when the wheel was invented in Mesopotamia. Before this revolutionary invention, transporting goods, people, even ideas, was an immense challenge. The wheel, however, changed everything. It was a game changer that transformed trade, warfare, and societal structures. Imagine a world where distance was no longer a barrier to exchange. It allowed societies to expand, interact, and evolve at unprecedented rates. The wheel was more than a tool. It was the driving force of progress. Yet progress wasn't just about movement, it was also about memory. Around a hundred years later, still in Mesopotamia, a new breakthrough emerged that would forever change how we remember and record our history, the birth of cuneiform writing. This was the first system of its kind, a way to inscribe words and ideas into clay tablets. Suddenly, humans had a way to document everything from business transactions to royal decrees, from poetry to prophecy. Cuneiform was a language of progress, a medium that allowed for the transmission of knowledge and culture across generations. In essence, the wheel and cuneiform writing were inseparable companions in our journey towards civilization. The wheel allowed us to explore and expand our physical world, while cuneiform writing enabled us to preserve and pass on our intellectual and cultural heritage. These two inventions paved the way for complex societies to develop for empires to rise and fall, for the human story to unfold in all its grandeur and tragedy. The wheel and cuneiform writing were the catalysts that propelled us forward into a new era of human history. They were our first steps towards the world as we know it today, a world of connected societies, shared knowledge, and continuous progress. These two inventions from over 5,000 years ago continue to shape our world in profound ways, they remind us of our shared past and our collective journey towards the future. As societies grew, so did their need for organization and advanced tools. Our journey takes us back to Sumer around 3500 BC, where the concept of city-states began to emerge. Imagine places like Uruk, Ur, and Eridu. These weren't just clusters of homes, they were the cradles of civilization, showcasing advanced architecture and societal organization. The rise of city-states marked a significant shift in human history, setting the stage for the bustling urban centers we know today. These city-states weren't just about impressive buildings and organized societies. They were also about the people who lived there, their culture, their beliefs, and their way of life. The development of these city-states was a testament to human ingenuity and the desire to create order out of chaos. As these city-states grew and flourished, so did the need for more advanced tools and technologies. This need ushered in the Bronze Age around 3300 BC. The discovery and use of bronze was a game changer. It wasn't just about creating more effective tools or weapons, it was about reshaping societies at a fundamental level. Bronze, being harder and more durable than its predecessor, copper, revolutionized many aspects of life. It enhanced agriculture by making tools more efficient, it transformed warfare by introducing more potent weapons, and it influenced art by providing a new medium for expression. The Bronze Age was more than just a period of technological advancement. It was an era that saw the rise of trade, the development of new crafts and professions, and the expansion of human societies. It marked a significant step towards the complex civilizations that were to follow. 
With the rise of city-states and the advent of the Bronze Age, civilization was beginning to take shape. The advancements during this period laid the groundwork for the world as we know it today. As we delve deeper into this fascinating era, let's remember that these developments were not just about buildings, tools, or trade. They were about people, their dreams, their struggles, and their triumphs in shaping a world that was constantly evolving. The next phase of our journey takes us to the spiritual and communicative innovations of the era. Around 3000 BC in Mesopotamia, we witness an architectural marvel that symbolized the spiritual depth of the civilization, the ziggurats. These massive steppe pyramids were more than just structures, they were central to religious life. Their construction required a level of planning and engineering that was incredibly advanced for its time highlighting the ingenuity of Mesopotamian civilizations. From here, we move to Egypt around 3200 BC, where the development of Egyptian hieroglyphics marked a significant leap in communication. These complex and intricate symbols were more than just a writing system. They played a crucial role in religious practices and documenting history. This form of writing allowed the Egyptians to express abstract ideas, record their history, and conduct complex administrative tasks, providing us with a rich and detailed picture of life in ancient Egypt. Our journey now takes us to South Asia, around 3300 BC, where the Indus Valley civilization began to take shape. Known for its advanced urban planning and sophisticated drainage systems, this civilization was far ahead of its time in terms of city life and infrastructure. Cities like Mohenjo-daro and Harappa were marvels of urban planning, with streets laid out in a grid pattern, advanced drainage systems, and impressive public buildings. These cities were a testament to the planning capabilities and societal organization of the Indus Valley civilization. These developments showcased the ingenuity, spiritual depth, and planning capabilities of early civilizations. The ziggurats, hieroglyphics, and the cities of the Indus Valley civilization are reminders of how far we've come and the foundations upon which our modern world is built. Our journey continues with a leap across continents and cultures. Let's now turn our attention to the Supa Valley of modern-day Peru, where around 3000 BC, the Caral Supe civilization began to flourish. It stands as one of the earliest in the Americas, showcasing the initial steps mankind took towards organized societies. The Caral Soup of Civilization was renowned for its monumental architecture, including grand pyramids that rivaled those of ancient Egypt. These structures stand as testament to the early American society's ingenuity and their ability to manipulate their environment on a large scale. Moving across the Atlantic, we land in England around the same period, 3000 BC, where the construction of the enigmatic Stonehenge began. This iconic structure, with its massive stones arranged in a circular pattern, is a testament to the engineering prowess of early Europeans. Stonehenge also provides a glimpse into the ceremonial and cultural practices of the time, although its exact purpose remains shrouded in mystery. This ancient monument still captivates us with its enduring enigma and architectural marvel. Finally, we venture back to Egypt, around 3100 BC, for the onset of the early dynastic period. This era marked a significant turning point in history as it saw the unification of Upper and Lower Egypt. This consolidation led to the development of a centralized administration, the establishment of a single Egyptian culture, and the strengthening of religious traditions. The early dynastic period laid the groundwork for the grandeur that was to become the Old Kingdom of Egypt, and its influence has echoed through the ages, shaping civilizations for thousands of years to come. These advancements were not only significant in their own time, but they continue to inspire awe and wonder today. Whether it's the monumental architecture of the Keral Soup, the engineering marvel of Stonehenge, or the powerful unification during Egypt's early dynastic period, these diverse developments highlight the remarkable capacity of human ingenuity and adaptability. As we've journeyed through these millennia, one thing becomes clear. Innovation is a constant in human history. We've seen how the wheel revolutionized transportation, trade and warfare, and how cuneiform writing enabled the recording of human accomplishments. City-states in Sumer set the stage for modern urban centers, while the Bronze Age transformed agriculture, warfare, and art. 
Ziggurats showcase the architectural prowess and spiritual depth of ancient civilizations, and Egyptian hieroglyphics revolutionized communication and religious practices. The Indus Valley civilization astounded us with its advanced urban planning, and the Karl Soup civilization provided a glimpse into the early development of societies in the Americas. The enigmatic Stonehenge stood as a testament to the engineering skills and ceremonial practices of early Europeans, while the unification of Upper and Lower Egypt during the early dynastic period shaped religion, culture, and governance for millennia to come. This era was a testament to human ingenuity and adaptability, reminding us of our potential to shape the future.